Yeah, welcome back to the channel everyone where we are back here on the angler for another competition weekend for the competition series we are in season two week number four here on the channel and we are back here in spain as you can see for the second time for competitions the first time we had mirror carp now we're back here for the second time so it's been a minute at least but we are following up last weekend's win where we had a Christmas win with the Arctic Char. What an amazing weekend that was. We didn't spend very much time at all. Real short amount of time, got a bunch of diamonds. I hope all of you that were able to watch that video were able to use that spot and land you some diamonds if you hadn't got any of those yet. But the Arctic Char, what a great weekend we had taking that top spot. Ah, it's wonderful. But this weekend is New Year's weekend, so Happy New Year to everyone, because by the time you see this video, it will be the new year, 2024, and I hope it's an amazing year for every one of you. Now, we are after the European eel here on Spain. Now, that means we're needing nighttime service, so hopefully we'll be able to find some of our friends here in the group that are competing, and they'll be on night servers, and we'll be able to jump around a little quicker, which is nice having the extra friends to be able to do that. Everybody will use each other to find those times on the server, because the nights go so fast in this game, you get a very little bit of time to fish. That's why we're probably going to be using these the bigger rod, because you got to get them in, but we'll cover that in a second. Now, the other awards we can get besides getting in that top three is the Lunker Award, which is the heaviest weight single European eel, the Dinklage Award, the lightest weight bronze minimum single eel, and we usually don't do that because I don't use a bronze hook. I almost always use a silver hook or above. Sometimes we may end up giving that a try, but I like to focus on silver and above. That's just how I like to do it, and I'm not, not too worried about you know going after it, but it'd be fun sometime. That's for sure. The other award is the highest scoring fish, which means you went after bigger eel with smaller equipment. Now, we're not going to do that because we did get the high score the first week or whatever. So I really just want to get these in. It's a night server, so you don't got much time. You want to get them in as fast as possible. The more, the better. You know, quantity <laughs> will get you quality sometimes in this game. So we want to use this uh, larger tackle for that. I'm not going to spend all that all the time on a smaller one. That is for sure. Not this weekend. That's my plan anyway. We'll see how it goes for us. It's a little early here in this spot where we're at. So it's only 1730. We're looking for 1900 to get to that night server when the eel will start hitting or at least a little bit before that. And uh, we just got a little bit of time to wait. But that being said, if you're interested in adding to your Call of the Wild Angler experience and you have Facebook, the link is in the description below for this group that we do the competitions in. Everyone's more than welcome. PC console, doesn't matter, but the link is in the description below. You can click that, you can join that group, and you can get into these competitions on the weekend with us. The more the merrier. Everyone's welcome. It is a good time, and you'll make some new friends and have a lot of fun fishing with them too. So just want to leave that there so everyone knows that that's available to you and uh, come out here and compete with us. Well, that's it, I guess. So we'll, we'll get onto these eel pretty quick. Happy New Year to everyone again. I hope you all enjoy the video. Uh, let's get to it. Hey, got an eel finally at 17.55, so that's good. What we got? It's like a silver, 5.5, something to start with. Awesome. Our first eel of the weekend is a 5.5 silver. Nothing to brag about, but it is a starting point. And you gotta do that. Could be a decent one. Six point five, we'll take that. That is uh, moving us up a little bit. Five, five, six, five. We'll take them. That one's a little heavier, maybe. Maybe a big silver. Thank <laughs> you. 
see. There we go. All right, on the board with a gold. 8.83. 8.83. That I can tell the difference in that one. They had a lot more pull to it. So now we got a good feel for that. That's awesome. I don't know how far off we are from diamonds. I don't have one yet. So, but 8.83. That's a great place to start. Trying to get that full bag of gold. I think that's big silver. I think it's big silver. Oh, nope. <laughs> there we go. 8.67 gold. Uh, just short of going over the halfway mark, so now we know. That's kind of what I thought. We're trying to play it safe. 8.67, 8.83. And a 6.5 now for our top three. One more gold to have a full gold bag already in the first hour, maybe two. Gold number three right there, 8.17. That's gonna give us all eight pounders. And that will be our smallest too, so that is our low bar. But 8.17, that is our fish to beat for now. But a gold bag already, not too bad. Ooh, that one looked pretty good and it feels pretty good. That might be another gold. Gotta be 8.17 if it does, or if it is. Oh, yep. <laughs> 8.72, that is our middle one. That knocks off the 8.17. 8.72 goes right to the middle. 8.67 is now our smallest. Our largest is 8.83. So ever increasing, getting a little closer to them diamonds. I know we got a ways to go into the nines yet, I believe. That's a little bit better for us. I wasn't expecting that. 883, we already have an 883, but we'll take a second one because that knocks off our 867. So two 883s and an 872 now. We still haven't got a diamond and we're getting to the last 24 hours. So fingers crossed something will happen here. Oh, here we go. We've switched to a gold hook. Competition's over, but we've switched to a gold hook. I'm tired of messing around with silver, so. Yeah, that's much heavier. That's better. Yeah, the competition is over, but I was like, I am not giving up. <laughs> not giving up. I, I want a diamond in one of these, so we're going to give it a try here. Before the video's got to come out. Oh, oh, 931. That is a big old gold right there. Very nice. Oh man, that's our biggest goal, but it's a 0.44 pounds bigger than anything else we've got. Man, I hope I can get this done before the video has to be out, guys. I really do. I might even push it to Friday if I don't get one, but we're going to try. Gold hook. I'm just going to sit here and try as much time as I can put to it. I didn't have enough time to get it done. There were so many people with diamonds. So many. It's not us. It wasn't our weekend, but... Man, that is a big, big gold, though. Oh, here we go. Maybe another gold, I'm guessing. That doesn't look like much bigger than... Looks smaller than the one that just hit. 
definitely wait longer with these gold hooks, that's for sure. Yeah. He's probably a little smaller. Oh, nope, he's actually bigger. Our personal best again, so maybe we're on our way to something. If we get these guys out of the way, maybe a diamond will pop for us. All right. All right, guys, that's where we are going to leave it here for the angler this weekend, which was season two, week four, where we were after the European eel. And we were way down in that area there. I had to go stock up on some, uh, some minnows, but... We were not able to come away with a diamond, which was my goal this week. It wasn't even about the competition. It was just about getting that diamond. I could not get a diamond deal. Some people did, some people didn't, but quite a few did. There was quite a few. Um, so I worked an extra four days after the competition just to try to see if I could get it in to get a diamond into the video to at least have something extra. But it was not meant to be, at least not this week, so maybe we'll give it a try in the future, but it is not happening for us. After our awesome win last week with the Arctic Char and having so many diamonds so quickly, the world spins around on itself and sets you straight. So we completely choked and, and, and lost out on that, but congratulations to all those that did get it and were able to put it in. We did get some bigger golds, after the fact, after those few days, I got quite a few 9 pound plus. We didn't get any 9 pluses, but the last few days I got some 9 pluses. I thought we were zoning in on a uh, diamond there soon, but it never did uh, happen before I need to get this done. And the new competition for this next week, the uh, week number 5 is out right now as I speak, because I'm just wrapping this video up. I'm going to put it out here on Friday for y'all, but... Uh, We'll see how next week goes. Hopefully it should be a lot better. We should have a lot better. <laughs> we'll see how that happens for us though, for sure. But that did it guys. No extra awards, nothing here, but thanks for being here and watching the video. If you can go after those eels. I spent our time over here, where I believe most of them were caught right here in this area. That's where most of them were caught. And I spent most of my time there. I spent a little bit of time here. I think a couple were caught there and a few up here in this hole, but we spent most of our time over here. I know there are some over here to the left a little bit, but we uh, spent a little time early there. But this is where we spent all of our time, and it just wasn't meant to be. Some random person did catch one next to me on the last couple of days ago after the competition had ended. But that's where we spent our time. It just wasn't meant to be. Sometimes, they, sometimes you get lucky, and sometimes you don't. Here's one of those weeks that we don't. I think this is only our second week that we didn't get a diamond of the species we were after. The brown trout week number two of the first season, I think. So one per season, that ain't too bad so far. We're doing really good. So it does happen. It happens to everybody. No matter how much time you put in, how much focus. I put extra time in, it still couldn't make it happen. So was not meant to be. That said, thank you all for being here at the end of the video. It's much appreciated. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and stay notified and shoot the like button to help others find the channel. If you didn't, thank you for watching this long. Back to work on our next video. Until then.